Hi, hello guys. So, uh, my name is Akit Sheikh and today I'm gonna show you something. A quick tip to adding vector graphics in your Google slide text. So we all know we have a, a set of shapes in Google slides. We can use them. We can draw them and uh, we can change the colors, the fill color and uh, as well as we can change the stroke colors as well so this is nice to use vector graphics and we all love this i know because i am a vector design lover so today i'm going to show you uh, what if we want to add some custom elements in our slide text like uh, we have these default shapes in Google Slides. We can add, but what if we need to add some font style that is not available in Google Fonts? And it's anything like this icon we want to add, but in vector. So what we can do, uh, the shortest way is I just need to copy this content and uh, I will paste this into my Google slide. But this is not what really I'm looking for because now you see uh, it's here. We got it nicely, but uh, there's something wrong that it's a bit edgy huh? because if I will scale it up, you can see there are sharp edges and uh, they are pixelated mm, so i'm not really a big fan of this but it, we, we can go while it, we have less time you can see it's all distorted here huh? so what we are gonna do we need to add some vector graphics here which we can add it kind of uh, the colors and if you scale them up they don't distract you so from here remember one thing for the font style uh, always make this font into a path so doing this we need to what we need to do we need to create outlines for this font Yes, so now this is not any more editable font. This is just a vector design. And what we gonna do next, we just need to export this file from file menu and uh, just select the file format, Windows Meta file, that is WMF, yes. So let me rename this file for me. This is asset and export. Now what we're gonna do, we will add this WMF file in our Google Drive. Okay, so I'm gonna add this file to my Google Drive. It's already a created folder. So just drag it and drop it here. We got it. Now we need to open this with Google Drawing. Um, from before Google Drawings was, was not supporting this vector conversion. Uh, I was using the Cloud Convert, which is an external extension. For the Chrome, but now Google is able to handle these vector graphics itself. So I'm going to open this with Google Drives. Here we go. Nice. So see now we got the vector element in Google Drive. Now what I'm going to do, I will just copy 
and uh, paste it here in my slide deck. I will change the color of the background. And you can see it's all vector here. Huh? I just need to quickly ungroup and group again for the different elements like this font. I can change the color which I need to use according to my brand lines or which my client needs and which suits my eyes well. So it's really handy and I really love this feature. So that's why I, I, I thought to share this thing with you guys. Huh? I hope you guys like this information and this tutorial and, and that's all. I'm really happy for this. Thank you for watching this video. And if you like it, just subscribe my channel and uh, like the video.